Well, I don't want to know how to do that. I had all that, and I couldn't get into the yard. It's amazing. Hi, and Carol. Congratulations. Great. Thank you. Minnesota is really a hotbed of health innovation. It has been for many, many years, decades actually, and uh, we need to keep that going. And so we've got to um, be training people. We have to be creating the pipeline of the next uh, set of leaders for that. And um, this, this is a good opportunity. We're, we're a um, an early stage company, so we are looking ahead to where we will source our staffing from as we uh, as we're growing. And uh, this program sounds like an excellent opportunity to connect with a lot of good people, well trained people. Uh, I think for them it's a great opportunity. HIT is where the people want to be in the next three four years with so much uh, uh, government government uh, thing of, of implementing an EMR in all clinical facilities. And also there are another thing like ICD-9 to ICD-10 conversion. There is so much demand for workforce in those two areas. So for these people who are graduating from the program, I think they are in a great place to look for work. That's, that's something they should be excited, right place to get employed. With our delivery um, business partners to support the products and applications that they use, we have 100, about 180 that we support. And a dental record as well as the electronic health. There's a huge movement with for-profit companies taking advantage of, of these employees, which you see here right now. And, and we're obviously one of those companies, being a healthcare management company, and our core service is IT, or information systems. So the students coming out of this, these programs, the four different programs, they all parallel what we're looking for in Canada. We're looking for people that have a mix of IT and healthcare in their backgrounds. So uh, we do interface analysis work for our clients. Uh, we get involved with implementation of uh, EMR systems, EPIC in particular is what we've done a lot of. Uh, so those are the kinds of skills we're looking for, people that are good analysts that, uh, that have uh, HL7 experience or healthcare experience. across a great individual today and looking for an opportunity, we'll be able to connect with the right employer and we'll be able to place them on a short-term and a long-term contract basis work or even a full-time employer. No, I think it's excellent. It's, it's a great opportunity to connect students with uh, prospective employers, the organizations that, that are going to be needing their skills. And, and I, I think the program itself, it's a, it's a great start and it's a great way of getting a lot of people interested and focused on the health information technologies, the health informatics, the things that, um, that we're really going to need both as a state and as a society to move ahead.